Hi, I'm Grace Padma, and I'm going to walk you through some things we've been doing around the community to improve our product management. What do I mean by product management? Well, number one, our task is to make sure that our users' voices are heard clearly. And number two, to make sure that solutions to those users' needs are delivered. Now, who a user is can vary depending on the context. But the point is that to get this important work done to serve our users well, it requires quite a lot of things from vision, prioritization, product execution, capacity building. Well, let's get a bit more specific. Here are just a few things we've been doing recently based on this feedback, the following feedback from around our community. I don't know what work is actually going on in OpenMRS right now. Well, this is a reasonable quote because um, sometimes when we meet just once a year for a conference or when there's many different meetings someone's involved in, they may not know what many other teams are working on. And sometimes this means you could have connected with them about an initiative that your organization was working on as well at the same time. So squads have been a helpful tool that we've used to avoid duplicated work and to share work together. But we come together now at the end of each month and the squads demo monthly what uh, they've been doing. We also now have a quarterly, every three months, uh, implementer showcase where implementers of OpenMRS and related uh, distributions from around the world come together and share, here's what we're working on, here are the needs we're hearing about in the field, and here's what we're prioritizing as a result. So these are some new mechanisms that we've been trying out. We also hear things like, I want to help, but I don't know where to begin. It's hard to get work done when requirements and priorities are not clear. Well, fair enough, because if you looked at our uh, issue backlog, which we use to manage tasks and work, this would be a fair response. We had 5,000 uh, roughly tickets with an average age of more than four and a half years old. So recently, we've been working on cleaning this up. We went through a community process to propose an initiative we called the graveyard. And in November, we closed all issues that had not been updated in more than a year. That was over 3,300 issues. What do you think the average age of those closed tickets was? It was six and a half years old. Well, the average year, uh, age of the tickets that remain is almost two years old. So we have more work to do in order to become more responsive and on top of the issues as they come in from our community and our users. And in order to get there, we're also going to need in step two to work on a fast triage process. Right now, we've got a, over 160 different projects spread across JIRA. There are many different workflows and permission nuances in many different states that an issue can get stuck in or confusion can arise. So we're currently working through monthly JIRA Ninja sessions where community members are welcome to join us and uh, come and talk with us about how we can improve our triage and issue review processes. You can see at any time how we're doing in uh, managing our backlog by looking at our JIRA Help dashboard. And I've given you a link for that there. But why does all of this matter? Well, here's two examples. In this screenshot, we can see how the micro front end squad has been using Epix to break down work into clear, manageable pieces that the different organizations in the squad can then share so that we each have clearly defined work, which we can then bring together in our sprints. Another example is with the recent RefApp 2.11 release planning. This, uh, we were able to use our backlog and, and manage it a bit better, uh, clean it up, to create a clear sprint plan for the steps we were going to take in order to get that shared community project out the door. And a key one is, I need to know what OpenMRS is currently trying to achieve. So what's our roadmap? Great question, I'm so glad you asked. Well. Um, enter the product dashboard. This wiki page is meant to be a home base, a dynamically changing one that reflects our community's current top strategic priorities. You can see these laid out here, as well as underneath the projects that are going on to support those three strategic priorities, which projects need more support. You can look for things you might be interested in. Let's take a quick look at that and we will look at this further later on in remaining sessions at the conference, but I can see here other initiatives that I might be interested in collaborating in, and I can see who's currently supporting them. Reach out to me if you'd ever like to talk more.